Like, I yeah. If I'm given a number, I think yeah, like what Yugi said, it would probably reach a 91, maybe higher. But sadly for the critics, I don't think it'll get higher. That's just me. The critic part of it is the hard part because, like yeah. I said, there seems to always be one person who's like, nah. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm like, yeah, I'm like, it should. In my opinion, it should get a 91. Yeah. But realistically, I think it probably won't get higher than that. I don't think it'll get higher than uh, Spider-Man. I'm going to... Okay, I'm going to be honest. I think... I think it's going to come in at a 95. I'm giving it a 95. I'm Give I'm me. just going for I'm shooting for the moon here. I'm going okay. for it. I think this is going to be one of the best super 2D side-scrolling Super Mario Brothers that has ever been made. Uh, which kind of brings me to my next two questions one it seems when it comes to game of the year stuff it's always like the big you know the big 3d games can super mario wonder if it comes in at a night at, at like 91 or above like we're thinking should it be a game of the year contender when you think about the other games that came out this year when yeah. you think about your like games that were really popular like your Baldur's gate 3 and your spider-man 2 and uh, your Tears of the Kingdom and maybe Diablo 4. Uh, what else? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I can't think of what else. Uh, Resident Evil 4 Remake. Oh, there it Hogwarts is. Legacy. Yeah. Like, there's been a Ooh. lot of good games this year. Mm -hmm. Can you throw Wonder in there? If it comes in at that high of a review score with all this hype yeah. around it. I think it does, but guaranteed it wins in its genre. It's going to win Best Platformer. I mean, let's be honest. Oh, yeah. I think yeah, it wins Best it's Platformer. definitely going to be. Yeah, it's going to be best platform of the year. Yeah, but probably, putting it next to all those other ones, I don't see why it wouldn't. But I don't. Yeah, I guess it'd be a different conversation of what how the people feel. Yeah, but I don't see why it wouldn't be up there with them. I think yeah. it definitely could stand toe to toe. Absolutely. I kind of agree. But from the games that I've seen inside of the uh, the game of the year awards, I'm scared to say that it might not. Mm. I'm like, yeah, I think it's definitely possible that it won't get up there, but I'd be very disappointed if it didn't right yeah i think based on like the history of the game of the year awards i think it probably doesn't because i think there's too many games to pick from this year but what i do think is that it wins best platformer and i think that it wins um best family game i think there's like a best family game category something like that yeah yeah. and since this has the local four-player co-op couch co-op uh and it's mario i could see it yeah. winning winning that for sure Maybe but even soundtrack, depending. It that might, because, hey, oh. the trailer, the soundtrack in the trailer is... Mm -hmm. <laughs> I told you earlier, it evokes that sense of wonder. It does. Uh, it does. Uh, wow, wow. <laughs> and there's all, and Mario has a lot of sound effects, too. And there are, like, the category right. is sound design, right? Is it soundtrack yeah. or is it sound design? So they I, got, could see they got it being, I could see it being a contender in both of those. Yeah, that's a good yeah. point. I hadn't thought about it. So... My last question for tonight, then, is, in your opinion, what is the best 2D Mario game of all time? And can Super Mario Wonder, be whatever that is, be better than that? <laughs> Falcon, what do you got? <laughs> Dude, you you sent this question in, and I already knew my answer. Like, the game popped in my yeah. head instantly when you said it. Okay, honestly, my favorite uh, 2D Mario game has to be uh, Super Mario Wii. Like, okay. that one, it's just... New I Super guess, Mario Bros. I'm Wii? Probably, I'm, I'm probably a little bit biased because that was the game that, that that's a childhood game, a childhood favorite that I played with my brothers. Uh -huh. We would play versus mode and we would play together mode, okay? Yeah. And like, we would still fight each other in both the modes. So anyways, point is that it holds a special place to my heart. The game is amazingly fun, okay? But do I think uh, Wonder can beat it? Easily. Easily. Okay, all right. <laughs> my expectations for Wonder are pretty high. Yes. Okay, well, you know what? New Super Mario Brothers Wii can't, comes in at an 87. Mm. So I think you're right. I think it can beat that one. And I agree with your analysis of it. I loved that game. It was <laughs> incredible. It was an incredible game. In fact, most, uh, most I'm married. Most people have like a bachelor party when they get married. And most people go out for their bachelor party. I stayed home and played New Super Mario Brothers Wii. At my, that was what we did for my bachelor party. It was oh my God. so much fun. Um, Dude, honestly, I didn't even think about that. I'm like, you know, when I get when I might get married, maybe Wonder will be the game that I play at my party. Yeah, yeah, maybe so. so yeah. Maybe so. You, you guys are my people. You know what I did? Uh, mine, I um, I got my boys together and my in-laws, and we did Halo, 
nice. uh, multiplayer matches. Split screen, yeah. Dude. Oh, oh, as my God. witness, I wish my in law was here. He actually that he he stomped me. I was like, dude, you didn't even play video games. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> like Dude, stompy like, in Halo it was crazy. I'm surrounded by fellow dorks. Um, oh, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs>